eventually comes back to you. So you gotta be careful, baby, and look both ways before you cross my mind. Hey, you guys, welcome back to another video. So today you might be wondering, um, why is she doing another slick bun tutorial? Did we already see that? Mm, what's going on? You running out of ideas? No. I just feel as though the first video that I did on a slick bun was not up to par. You know like when you look back on something and you were pressed about it, but then you look back and you're like, mm, that could have been better. And I feel as though it doesn't really represent how my buns look on a regular basis. So this video is just an updated um, slick bun tutorial slick bun slash ponytail tutorial and I have a few new products that I'm going to be using so that you can see what I've you know used other times when I don't use the stuff that you saw before and yeah I hope you enjoy this video um I do have a shirt on guys uh, yeah so <laughs> nice try but yeah so let's get into this tutorial I hope you enjoy it so my hair was just dampened. My hair was looking a hot mess, y'all. I woke up out of bed, my bonnet, my bonnet was on, but the scarf was off, so my edges was crusty, but everything else was fine. I don't I, I don't know why the bonnet and the scarf just can't stay on together. But anyway, so my hair is wet and I'm going to show you what I use. I just used a spray bottle and I literally just went like this. I dampened my hair. And the new product that's not new because I've used it before, just not on YouTube, is Cantu. And this is the Cantu Shea Butter Leave-In Conditioner. I feel as though everybody knows this product. Like, if you don't know Cantu, then I don't know what you can do. <laughs> that was so ugly. But yeah, so I'm just gonna use a little bit of it just to moisturize my hair. My hair is moisturized, and now what I'm going to do is section my hair so I'm going to take a piece from this section so here's one so now you have two ponytails if you look at my past tutorial this is exactly how I did it before nothing has changed with the way that I do it it's just what I used and a better outcome and I'm going to take my eco style my favorite eco styler gel Besides the black castor oil and flaxseed oil gel, because that one is bomb too. But I'm just going to take it and I'm going to run it through the back of my hair, the section that's not in the ponytail. I'm going to use my brush. Now you guys, I know in my past video, I said, where is it at? I said that I was not going to not use this brush unless the bristles were all the way gone, but... I just recently received this new brush. It's a Conair hard bristle brush. I think from the beauty supply store or Sally's or Ulta, one of those places. Y'all, I'm so sorry. Like this is the OG brush. Like it's always, like we go way back. But this brush, I mean, I was like, I've been missing out for however long. Like this brush will have your hair slick. And I mean slick. And I'm gonna show you, you're gonna see. So I'm just gonna brush the back section. I'm going to take this ponytail out to gather the back section up. So I'm gonna take this ponytail out, dampen it some more. As you can see, my hair is kind of really damp right now. It's almost reverting back to its natural, natural state. And I don't really like doing it when it's like that, but right now it'll be fine. And I'm taking some more Eco Style Gel, if you can see. And I'm just putting a little bit more on. So now I'm taking this back section out and I'm just going to gather all the sections that we just dealt with together. And it should be easy to grab because we just separated them and separately 
brush them down so it shouldn't be that hard to manage that's the whole point of separating your hair in those buns and then doing the back section first like it all ties in together it's all for a reason we're not just doing this just to do it So my hair is pretty slick right now, but we are not done yet. I'm going to take my Eco Salad Gel again and this toothbrush, this raggedy toothbrush that I've had for the longest. But it works, y'all. I feel like the longer you have it, the harder the um, toothbrush gets and then it really can secure the hair as you're pushing it back. So I'm going to do my edges. Now the way I like to do my edges with a side part is I like to take a little bit from the top part right here and bring it, like kind of steal it, and move it to this side. And actually, I have a mirror so I can see this better. And I'm gonna take some more Eco Styler Gel and work with this top part. And I like to move it at an angle so that you still have this left because what you're going to do with that piece is you're going to swoop it just like you did on the other side. And then I'm going to take this big brush and really just bring it all back. I'm going to take this new gel that I got that I absolutely love. The last time I had this was last year and I lost it and I was so mad. But it is the Blueberry Bliss Edge Control by Curls. Let me see. And oh, it just smells so good. Like, it's so good. It's a hard gel because, like I said, the formula for success is a hard gel and a water gel. You gotta have it. The hair will be secure, girl. It'll be secure. I'm really pushing like because I really need this to be slick so don't be afraid to be rough if you're not tender-headed you should be good I'm not tender-headed I don't even feel what I'm doing like I'm numb okay. it's almost done guys I'm just so I have I diagnosed myself with OCD I know I have it because I just need things to be particular I need just to have some more gel so that it can stay so when I put my scarf on it doesn't lay the wrong way oh I think that rhymed y'all replay that and see if I rhyme because that was kind of cool I'm gonna curl them make it look really cute and flirty you know girl next door look and I'm gonna take a little bit from here too because of the fact that this is a side ponytail I'm sorry I keep talking to myself let me talk to you guys because this is a side ponytail you want to add a piece of hair to this side so that it adds symmetry not symmetry but it just I don't know exactly what it does but it makes it look good so I mean why not do it so I went to the bathroom and I fixed some things because I couldn't really see from this um, location but what I'm going to do is, you see I added this little edge because I wanted it to be more edgy. It wasn't enough edges for me. So what you're going to do with those sections, if you choose to, you don't have to. This is just me being extra. We're going to do some edge art. If you do your edges, you're an artist. I'm just going to leave it like that. Kind of like Superman with his little thing. You know what I'm talking about. Give this a thumbs up. But yeah, I'm going to put my scarf on, you guys. Because without the scarf, this style could go down in flames. And I leave it on for about 15 minutes or until I remember that it's still on my head. And I'm like, what the heck? Let me take this off. And yeah, that's what we're going to do. I really look like I'm about to go to bed, y'all. But because, I mean, I got my pajamas on still. It's... Saturday morning you know I just finished doing my work and I felt like filming a video so sorry I'm not all glammed up but you look at my videos you're gonna get the real me this is the real me so yeah um 
I'll be back. Okay, y'all, so the scarf is off and I love it. I'm so much more satisfied than I was after that first video. And I hope that y'all are too. As you can see, my edges lay pretty well, especially my little friend right there. And honestly, guys, because I'm extra, I just need to do one more thing. And I want to show you guys what I do. I want the curls to be a little bit more defined. So I'm going to take my spray bottle and spray the hair. And I'm just going to just take my Eco Styler Gel and just twirl the hair around my fingers just to make some curls so that it doesn't look so dry, you know what I'm saying? And I'm finished finger coiling my ponytail. So yeah, the curls are very bouncy, they're very vibrant. I love them and I'm just loving how, how well this came out. I'm very satisfied. So this is how I do my slick buns. This is the new products that I use, the Cantu, the um, Curls Blueberry Bliss Balm, the brush that I use, the Conair brush, all these things just tied in together to make a wonderful product, which is this. So I hope you enjoy. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Have a great day. Yeah. Let's get